Hello, we are Team Rudra, the official mass rover team of SRM Institute of Science and Technology. We are a team of 26 students from mechanical, electronics, life sciences, developers, and corporate, and we are proud to introduce you to our new rover. We at Team Rudra are committed to push the boundaries of knowledge and development of new methods. This year, we have upgraded our rover's drive system to an adaptive suspension mechanism. This uses a robust passive independent spring suspension mechanism to stabilize the rover on uneven terrain and the independent adjustable height of the suspension gives the rover varying ground clearance, manual control over the center of mass and the ability to get out of the situation when the rover gets stuck in the tough spots. The 5 degree of freedom robotic arm manipulator is powered by up configured cyclonal drive which is designed and manufactured from scratch in house using 3D printing and 3-axis CNC milling machines. For equipment servicing mission, the gripper has differential yaw and roll mechanism, allowing it to perform tasks such as toggling switches and operating joysticks. DC motor coupled with cyclonal gearbox provides us with enough power to lift around 7 kg at the end effector. During the extreme delivery mission, the gripper along with the arm is used to pick up the object and store it inside the astronaut assistance box located at the back of the rover, allowing us to drop the object at the specified spot. All rover systems on board the rover for a particular mission weighs less than 50 kg. Robotic arm is replaced with bio arm in the science mission. The bio arm accommodates the auger that collects the soil sample from the ground and transports it to the funnel that leads to the test tubes and inside the bio box and st a storage compartment. The science domain is dedicated to making the rover equipped with the science payload that consists of instruments and assays to determine the absence or presence of either extant or extant life. The collection of the samples will be done using an auger mechanism and transferred equally with the help of funnels into the respective falcon tubes present in the centrifuge setup. These samples are analyzed using Catalase, Bradford and Sudan test which will serve the purpose of determining the presence of life. The arm of the auger consists of multiple gas and physicochemical sensors to detect the gases like hydrogen sulfide, ammonia, carbon dioxide, methane and hydrogen released while drilling the soil. A digital microscope is attached with a rover which provides a magnified live feed of the rocks to analyze its structural features. This year, our electronic system comprises of two custom PCBs which integrate the primary and secondary systems. NVIDIA Jetson TX2 and Jetson Nano equipped with GPS, Compass and inter -real sense camera are our primary processing unit. Two Sabertooth motor drivers are being used for driving four 24-volt Bain mod motors and six LiPo batteries will be powering the entire system. A kill switch has been incorporated to terminate all power supply to arm and drive in case of an emergency. For communication, we are using 2.4 GHz spectrum coupled with omnidirectional antenna at access point giving us a range of 1.4 km with low latency and 900 MHz to 1.3 GHz for visual feed. This time, the developer's domain has made major improvements in drive, arm and autonomous navigation system. Learning from previous experience, we have revamped our workflow to enable faster testing, debugging and incorporating new changes. The real-time tasks are executed on the microcontroller while the compute-intensive tasks use the GPU for parallel processing. Each system is monitored using extensive log messages indicating the precise system state. The autonomous navigation has tunable behavior according to the mission and can be monitored from the ground control station through a powerful GUI. We have worked really hard to ensure the simplicity and correctness for each of our subsystems. We aim at continuing our work, succeeding in our visuals and abiding by the motto of Rudra.